Hello, everyone, and welcome to Coloritaville. Today, I have these beautiful paint marker pens that I want to share with you guys. These are from Chocola, and there are 20 of them. They are acrylic paint markers, and what makes these nice little pens unique is the nibs are reversible. It comes with a three millimeter nib fine, which will flip around and become a chisel nib. Isn't that amazing? I've never heard of that before. Disclaimer, it is a tiny bit messy. So make sure you keep a cloth or something nearby if you want to uh, switch those nibs out. Um, I'll show you on, I think this one's one I've already flipped. Yep. See that? I've already flipped this. It's the chisel nib. But now that these come out without any effort at all, they just slide right out so nicely. So just slip it out, turn it around, gently push it back in, and wipe your finger. And there you go. You have a three millimeter lid nib. So you can go back and forth between nibs if you want to. These pens are also clear. So what you see inside is the ink. So you'll be able to see as your ink begins to um, empty out of the pen, how much ink is left inside. You can tell by looking at the cap colors and the ink colors that they're almost spot on. So that's something I really, really like a lot also about these. They have the clips here, so they're not going to roll around on your desk if the lids are on them, if they are on your desk, you know, you don't have to worry about them rolling around and things like that. I like that. They come in a, a cardboard box, which just gives you a little information, tells you um, how to prime them, gives you the color names. So you have that. And um, what I did notice when I, I got these started is, you know, I went ahead and primed them off camera because that can take some time with paint markers. But what I did is I made sure I shook them up really good, like, you know, really, really, really shake it and, you know, do that for maybe 15, 20 seconds and then take the cap off and push downward and hold it for just a few moments and then start to pump it to prime it and the ink seems to flow much faster. Um, normally what I've done with paint pens in the past is just pumped. And that was taking forever. What seemed to work best was pushing it down, holding it for a few moments, and then starting to press that. So let's take a look at the colors. So you can see the color range in these. I will tell you the names. The one downfall here is that even though there are color names for these, they're not on the pen. That was the one negative that I found on the about these that's really the only thing i've been able to point out that i did not you know really like so let me show you guys these colors they're pretty easy to identify based off their color names and the little chart to the side so this is going to be a luminous yellow and i'm going to come in so you guys can see a little bit so this is luminous yellow okay and then you have pineapple yellow. And pink taffy. Orchid purple. And oh, I love this orchid purple. You know, and if, if your nib ever starts feeling a little dry, just kind of push down on it a couple times and it gives it ink back into the nib. Um, I think that purple is just gorgeous. This is warm ivory. That's nice. Warm ivory. Okay, sherbet orange. Okay, then we have French Rose. Let's 
some of these I flipped over to chisel, so I'm trying to watch before I just put it down. Electric pink. Deep Charisse pink. So it's getting, oh, this one's the chisel. That's why it was like that. <sighs> chisel. Candy apple red. Then the white, set it off to the side for a minute. Um, pitch black, I'll let the black dry and then we'll put some white over the top to see kind of how it does. And I expect that it might, the black might bleed through with the white a little bit since I'm gonna be putting wet paint back onto the paint, but we'll see. This is your metallic silver, and it is very metallic-y, so I like that. Um, you have your bright gold. Also very shimmery. Coffee brown. Emerald green. Turquoise. I love that. That color is gorgeous. Soft blue. blue, royal blue. I actually like this royal blue and I'm generally not a fan of this color of blue, this type of blue, but I like that royal blue. It's very nice. And lime green and this is turned onto the chisel end. So there you go. So that's the colors you get. Let me test this black paper still feels damp, so I expect it to show through, but I'm not getting any paint off on my finger, so maybe it'll be okay. And let's just put some white dots so we can see our white. There we go. All right, so tell me down in the comments what you think about the color range and what do you think about the uh, reversible nib? Do you think that is a neat thing to have on um, a paint pen? Or if you see any downfalls, tell me about that too. What you know? What do you think? So these are available on Chocola.com's website as well as over on Amazon. There are links down in the description below that will take you over to either of those websites so you can purchase these. If you're interested, Chocola also has other types of products. They have watercolor brush pens. They have um, other types of paint markers. Um, they have a fine, a, even a finer tip nib than this. I'm not sure if it's reversible or not. Um, they have chalk markers and lots of other little things over there on their website. So go over, show them some love. And the links are down in the description. I also have a couple coupon codes for you guys if um, you're interested in purchasing anything from the Cho from Chocola brand. If you go over to Chocola.com and you enter Donna in 10, you will get 10% off on Amazon. If you purchase anything Chocola and enter the coupon code Chocola10, you will get 10% off of that purchase as well. So you've got coupons right here that you can use. I will list them down in the description below along with all the links to get you over there and get you going. So I hope you enjoyed this video. Please give me a big thumbs up, share it with your friends, subscribe to the channel, ring the bell to be notified of all of my future uploads. Until next time, guys, peace, love, and happy coloring. Bye, guys.